I want to say it was like this is a sprint out pass. We just happened to be in a, a good coverage for the sprint out pass, and we practiced. So we pretty much still right to me after that. Uh, that almost looked like a targeted play to you. Yeah. 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 Uh, <laughs> Uh, then, you know, the defense hasn't allowed a touchdown in the first two games. Just how much kind of pride do you guys take in that fact uh, through two games? I think we take a lot of pride in it for sure. I mean, we just want to be obviously dominant no matter who we play. So that's a great, that's a great thing is to take your pride in that. Um, and so I think we've seen you play some safety, some nickelback. You obviously have a straight playing cornerback here. Why have you been able to be so versatile this season? Um, well... First, I just think the coaches just trying me at different spots that they could help the team, and um, I'm up for the challenge. I don't mind changing a little bit, adding more tools to the game. Do you feel like because you're a veteran player, you're more capable of being able to handle all those different responsibilities? Uh, that could be so, but I think it's, it's <coughs> that, that I have some of the different tools that, that I could do. That could be. Thanks. Well, uh, different instances during the game where defensive plays led to major changes on the offensive side. The block field goal turning into the offensive run of touchdowns, then the missed field goal turning into the score just before the half. What kind of difference does it make to you um, when the defense can make those type of plays that can alter the momentum of the game so significantly? I mean, I for sure love those type of plays because like, I feel like we all just speed off one another after that. It's pretty much more and more energy, so I for sure love the energy.